And the other thing with a lot of people is that they're afraid of what will happen if they don't do it. Like, so what are you afraid of? And this is when the stoic philosophy comes into play. What are you afraid of happening to you? Like, okay, so if I don't take this job, I'm not going to have this money. Well, what, what, where do you live? Well, I live in this amazing place. I'm like, well, do you need to live in this amazing place? Again, I'm preaching to the guy who made minimalism. Um, but do you need that place? What, this is perfect for my audience. <laughs> like, what do, you, what do you really need? And what's the goal? So that mentality is what I took into Meg into making the movie. I'm like, what do I need? I need a camera. I need sound. I need. The, I, I took it straight down to the minimal things that you need to make a movie. And that's what we did. There was no, you know, my my actress was my slate girl and the craft service table. You know, I was camera. I was DP. I was the gaff. I had the guy holding the boom because he wasn't a sound guy because I literally just showed him how to use the recorder before he got there. <laughs> I've done that. Yeah. You know, and, I, and it worked, you know, yeah. and it because I did enough research to figure it out. I taught myself. But you have to figure out what is the minimal things. Like, I'm like, oh, I'm hungry. Like, well, what's what's the worst food that you can buy when you're broke? Like, do it to yourself. Mm -hmm. And that will teach you not to be afraid of something. So if you're afraid, I'm like, man, if I only eat rice and beans uh, for a month, what's going to happen to you? Give it, give it a try for two weeks. You'll live. Yeah. Put some salt and pepper on there. Got you're, yourself a stew. You know, you're good. Yeah. Will you survive? I'm not saying you're thriving in that world. Yeah. But will you live? Yeah, you will. Don't be afraid of those things. Don't be afraid of 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 uh, of things that you've built up in your own head. Do you need five rooms in your house? No, maybe you could just get an apartment. And now your overhead's lower, so now you have more freedom to do other things that you, this other all this baggage you've been putting on top of you is, is is doing. You know, I've gone through it myself, and to the point where now I'm like trying to downsize and like we were talking about earlier before the show is like it's hard to downsize with when you have kids yeah it's always a little bit more difficult it's a little bit more difficult you know i got uh, twin girls so it's a little bit a little bit more challenging but my wife and i have been trying to slowly pare things down pare things down what do we really need um and it's not easy it's not easy it's you know we don't make it all the time we're not perfect either but it's at least that mentality and so i'm not afraid of like what will happen, which was the fear of making a feature. Mm -hmm. Like what happens if it goes out there and no one likes it? I didn't care. 